Hello there everyone, today we have something else. Welcome to my mountain of shame everyone. Uh, today we have a uh, Grab the Bottle. Uh, 2017 game from uh, Camia, Camina Dimension. This game I did not receive for free. This game I actually paid for. And I'd be like, okay, why? First of all, well, it was only 72 cents or something like that. So it was, it was literally nothing. I was just like, sure, why not? But I decided I wanted to buy the Sakura bundle, despite the fact that it was ignored on my uh, list now for many, many, many years. Like I've ignored all the titles of the Sakura s series. I've, I haven't bothered to ever look into them because they're always terrible things. I regretted that choice. I haven't rolled it yet, but I'm afraid I will, so I decided I would buy some more cheap, easy games to help fill out my list and reduce the chances of getting Sakura. That has led me to try out this new game, Grab the Bottle. Um, so, it's new to me anyway. So amazingly, this game is having the, uh, the rare fact of being taken off my mountain only very recently after being added, so... Let's see if it's any good. Time to play Grab the Bottle. Now, I hope that doesn't mean we need a controller. I do have one here, but I'm gonna try and see if I can do keyboard and mouse, because I prefer that. So, oh, keyboard. Hmm. Options, relatively basic, I can see. At least that's got some separate mouse sliders, which is good, I suppose. So, that's fair. Language settings, so I suppose it's good. Sumoi. Oh, okay, that's a random one to have. English and two other Asian languages then randomly Finnish. Okay, sure. I guess that means that maybe the people who make it are, are that way inclined. Anyway, um, so anyway, let's, let's give this a go. Grab the bottle. How bad can it be, really? 72 cents worth, that's all I need. Alright, so it looks like first step is tutorials, so fine. There's a baby who wants to grab something. I am seeing, I'm guessing this is going to be the pattern of the story. Left, right, speed up is down, grab and pull. Oh, okay, grab and pull is, is up. Your goal is to get the bottle and grab it. Press grab to start the game. Maneuver the bottle, avoid hitting anything along the way. You have three hit points. Oh boy, okay. Sure, why why not? Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh that's a door. That's an open door. I didn't even see that. Can I go down here? Yeah, I can. Okay, so. Already failed at this. Oh. Huh. Can I just grab the crab instead? I'm I'm glad I didn't die, but I I kind of feel bad for not seeing the um, the door. Oh yes, I was going to start my timer. So I said that was a good good sign last time that I was liking the game, but at the moment it's more. I'm sort of like what about the game? But fair enough. You need to collect every collectible before grabbing the bottle. I mean, do you need to? I, if they're collectibles, aren't they op optional? By okay, sure. Upright uh, corner shows how many there are left. Okay, so I gotta get my. I'm, I'm, I d I'm Australian, so yeah, but I've got to get my um, binky. Yeah. She doesn't want to admit Australians caught, but I also love Rugrats, so you know. Okay, cool. And then pull it back. Fantastic. Okay, so far so good, but you know, that's understandable. I am literally a baby at this point. A baby that's apparently invisible. Big round objects with a blue outline can be pushed forward by ramming your hand into them. That sounds dangerous, but okay. Why only particularly blue objects? Sure, how bad could it be? Okay, but can I... Yeah, I was gonna say, I would rather see what I'm doing, thanks. Alright, well that was fairly expected. Wait, so what's the point of the up button? I just need to hit the bottle. I didn't even... Okay. okay. Sure. It said I had to press a button, and I have been, but... 
Oh, apparently the baby really wants some milk now. Fair enough. Alright, often you need to grab and pull objects. Okay, I was about to say that. With blue glow. Press and hold grab to start pulling the box. Over in the back. Drop the item by letting go of them. But okay, so that's where the... Okay. Obstacles of red outlines need to be dealt with. Okay. This might mean destroying them or interacting with them by other means. Find the right way. Alright, so I need to pick up... Okay. And drop it, but I'm also noticing there's not that much space. So I hope it does let me go backwards when I do that. Alright, look, I'm just gonna go through here. I hope it lets me go backwards. Okay, it does. Okay. So if I let go... Okay, that's fair. Oh, shoot. I made a mistake. I made another mistake. Well, okay, I'm glad they at least let me go back. <laughs> I see, so I've got to give myself enough space so they can actually drop it and use it. So I've got to think about where the barrel, the, the bottle has gone and where it will go. Okay, you can press speed up. Yes, I did that as well. Careful though, it makes turning more difficult. Yes, I picked that up as well. All right, I will be. Um, got to destroy that, got to get that. Okay, so I've got to probably go around the entire outside. Or do I? That's got to be destroyed. Is I need to go, oh, I need to go up, maybe, and then around, and then pick this up, and then pull it back, and drop it, and then go through, there we go, that's fair, that's reasonable. I, I do wonder about the, okay, you know, I'm not going to question this game. I find it odd that the collectibles aren't optional. <laughs> Alright, some objects are fragile. Be careful when <laughs> when and where you're about to drop them. Okay. Well, I've got to drop it over there. And I've got to get the glass. It means I've got to go down, around, and then... Oh boy. Okay. Fair enough. Let's go this way. And then this way. Okay, I think I go up here, I guess, and give myself enough room to get around. So there we go, that's where I can drop them. And now I go up here. Yeah, nothing too crazy at the moment. This is fairly reasonable. Oh, I was afraid that was going to actually break. It probably should have, to be honest. Oh, no. Gotta go this way, sorry. Alright, will you move, or have I blocked myself out? I've blocked myself out, haven't I? Okay. Okay, I'm seeing a problem here, and that is that if I put my arm through there... Hmm... I guess I've got to go up more than this. That's fine. Let's try going up here, then. So... We go here... And then we go here... And I probably should go around the outside because I don't want to risk trying to get through there. And there we go. Uh, okay. Fair enough. This should be fine, I hope. And there we go, right down here. Push this out of the way. Push this out of the way, I said. I said push this out of the way. Uh, okay. Well, I lost the level. I, I, I feel kind of bad about that, to be honest, but okay. <laughs> Guess it's got to happen eventually with an easy game. Well, it's, it's not necessarily easy. I don't know. It looks easy. It feels easy, but who knows? Sometimes you need to pull levers, door handles, camp, clamps, and other such things. You can tell these from their blue outline. Okay. Well, if the level's too big, you can look around before starting by pressing left or right. Okay. Remember, you can always pull your arm back by grabbing objects. Okay. All right, fair enough. Oh. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah, it's good. you might get hard. I see, I see. So, I apparently need to grab the clamp. Do I grab the clamp up or down? I also need to get down there, drop something in there. So, I've got to go there. And then I can go back to the... 
He's actually around. Okay. Okay, sure. Let's work this out. So if I go up here. Okay, I'm clearly wearing a different shirt now, so at least that's good, right? Can I can I drop this out on here? Can I decrant that? Yes, I can. Not sure what the value of doing that was, and whether it was a good idea. But it wasn't actually. In fact, I'm pretty certain it wasn't. Oh. Okay, that's a surprise. Can I? No, I need to actually survive. So I should've gotten that before. Okay. I see. I think I need to restart this one, to be honest. Nope, it's okay. Let me restart. I actually need to lose. Okay. I need to get that one on my way through, apparently. Because apparently that gets knocked off. So. I also want to get that one, so I don't know. Who said this? Nope. Okay. Oh, can I literally just... Sure. Okay, that was a surprise, to be honest. This feels like a bad idea. I feel like I've already lost this again. I had a plan, then I completely failed it, so... It's okay. It's okay. I need to get. I need to do a way of getting it back around. If that was fast. I didn't know it was fast. We get opposite of fast. Wow, that was literally the worst. Okay, yeah, no. Okay, which probably means I gotta go. Okay, what if I go up here? So put that there. Pull that. Okay. Um, probably need to be higher than that. Okay. If I drop this down, does that hurt me? Yeah, I get that, but like, what happens when I completely grab it? Do I have to go from a different certain direction? Apparently so, okay. Well, then I failed again. Hmm, interesting. Uh, can I touch myself? No. No, uh, apparently that is, it's not gonna to touch yourself. Okay, 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 I think I'm, I think I'm missing something here, so. Hmm. I want to get that one before I drop that one down. The only way I can think of doing it is if I could somehow pick up the the thing in the box. But I can't really pick up the thing in the box until I'm ready to be returned, so... Okay, I'm just going to, I'm going to go with my original plan. I actually had an original plan that I completely forgot because I wanted to pay attention to that. I'm guessing I should have went with my, my original plan. So I was sort of just exploring. This is what I wanted to do in the first place um, by going around the outside and then going to this thing over here. So I probably should have just went with my original plan in the first place, but yep, that was exactly what I needed to do, wasn't it? I really just need to go with the first plan I came up with and then got sidetracked and didn't do. You know what? Screw you, game. <laughs> okay, it's not the game's fault. I literally just got sidetracked. I was like, ooh, what if I do this? Like, what do these clamps do? Oh, boy. Hmm, need to make sure I give enough space so I can get back around. Okay. Which I do. I do have enough space, I think, so. You know, no, I'm... Yes, I just proceeded to make this level a hell, hell of a lot more difficult than it needed to be, and for no reason. So, good job, me! I can imagine everyone screaming, being like, it sounds like you did... Okay, no. They probably didn't hear my original plan, but that was my plan, damn it! Uh, okay. Alright, so what does the red mean? Rabbit! Oh, I see, I gotta avoid that, because... Okay, excuse me. Okay. Sure, but what does the red mean? I need to know what the red means. Probably death. I'm probably gonna destroy that, I'd imagine. Okay. Sure. I can grab that to go back. So if I go through here, push this, there we go. Then I. Ah, uh, is the other one strapped away in there? Okay. So if I pick up the potato head, drop it on the. Oh, I, I didn't even notice that it was in the, in the foreground. There's nothing wrong with me, is there? And I pull it back. I drop it on the ca castle. I get this. Like so. Oh no. What have I done? 
Let's move to the other way. Oh. That's okay. I was meant to somehow go the other way. It's fine. Oh, shoot. These foreground objects. Okay, so let's just let that go. Problem is, this time I've got to get the other one, but I don't think I can get that, so I am unsure. I, I, if I go one way, I block off the... Unless I'm meant to go twice around that, that... Okay. I What if what if the first thing I do, the very first thing I do, right? Is go over this thing, okay? Then I turn back around in here. Go in here. And then I push this out. Yeah, for a 70 cent game, there's nothing really wrong with this per se. Problem is I still I still have to go the other way in some way because yeah, see, I've still got to make a larger gap around here, because... Yeah, no, see, there's my problem. I still got to go higher than I did. I got to make, like, a little roundy loop the loop so I can drop it over the last... Yeah, it's got to be really high. It's got to go... It's got to go up here. Oh, damn it, I keep doing that. It's annoying. I'm actually going to go all the way up here so I can still have the loop. Because at this point, that's where I want to drop it. So, yeah. Now I should be able to turn around and get it, so we're fine. Okay. That's fine. So as long as it's up high enough, I should be right, because then I can just turn around, get it, and go in to get the bottle. So we should be right. Okay, so I grab it, and I wait until I get all the way back around, and then I drop it, and then I get the, to get the way through. This is fine. I think I've worked it out. It just took me way too long. There we go. See? Now just go not fail at a simple task. And make a giant penis, apparently. Well, you know, not a giant, but well, he is a giant with some swings in the background, but like I'm not a very excited one, I, I have to admit. I'm definitely nothing being, okay. And... All right, so we've got one thing in there I need to get. We've got one thing in there I need to get. One thing over there I need to get. Okay, what's well, definitely getting harder. Oh, and there's one back there? Okay, but it looks like I can't... I think I can... Mm. Can I get around the... I think I did before, so I just gotta go around entirely. No, see, I've also gotta destroy that, so I might have to go this way. So if I go that way... Then there, then drop, then back... Oh, uh, I don't know. Okay. This is requiring too much full planning. Okay, so what if I go directly up here? Now, I kind of want to, there's some way I still want to drop, but since I don't have to drop straight away, I wonder. Can I go through this way now as well? Do that, yeah, cool. Now, that will need to be pushed later. But for now, I just want to pick up this. There we go. And I need to drop it on the sandcastle so they can push it out of the way and get the, the ball out of the way. There we go. Now let's go this way so I can push the ball out of the way. There we go. Ball out of the way. Yeah. So I, I got the right idea here at least. It just, I was just like, there's a lot of steps I need to think about. So, you know, fair enough. Well, that, that was strangely... Yeah. Okay, so I'm growing up and now it's just like, you need to go in the attic because I've got some fine taste in there. Like, where's the root beer? It's in the attic, dear. It's like, hmm, the attic, you say? If only I had a way of getting up there. Okay, so he's literally been told 
It's in the attic. And instead he's just like, Nah, man, let's check, let's just have some regular pop out of the fridge. Okay. Oh, I was hoping that would get far, far enough to just go. Like that? Yeah. Oh no, am I meant to move this? <gasps> I meant to destroy that, I see. Oh no, what have I done? I meant to destroy that. Oh god, okay. That's fine, I've got an idea. It's fine. I'm gonna go up this way. Like so. Then pick up that. And then go back. Then drop. Wait, what? What? Was that not heavy enough? Was... But it was blue! But it was blue! Okay. Okay, so clearly that is just a reversal thing. Hmm. Can't go back up and down that same area though, so... It can probably definitely be broken, but I must have to go for the... Shelf? First? Okay. Let's go for the refrigerator first then. Okay. I mean, I feel like that would have happened regardless, but sure. Alright, so if I pull this back, like so... Okay. Drop the cheese. Wow! That was really successful! Thank you! Now, drop the cheese there! Sounds like some sort of weird euphemism, but that's okay. This plate is apparently invulnerable, which is probably a good thing, because I don't really want to break my grandmother's plates. That seems rude. Like, seriously, not a very good, good grandson. Also, if he drinks this, if he drinks pop, that's all he's getting, it's hunters of this. How much energy does it take to do this? I don't know. Okay, so... Oh god, okay. Lots of things I need to drop. Fair enough. Hand is there, so I've got to pull that up first, I'm guessing. Okay, so... Full hand, fine. Apparently I've got to push that so it lights that on fire, then I can go around. Wait, there's actually several different... Okay, so I actually need to go the other way first. That's the end goal. So I need to go through there first, then... That also needs to be broken. Oh. Okay, let's, let's just do it. If I... If I wait too long, it'll... Okay. Okay, sure. It shouldn't have went that way, actually, so let's uh, not. I should go up here. Okay. I wasted way too many things go up there, but I think that is the right way, at least. Now, if only he knew how to, like, close things again, he'd be fine. Like, if you could just pull back his arm without being receiving an invitation. Oh, actually, wait, what? Oh no, I can't go through here, can I? Oh, I thought that would let me go back through, but no, it doesn't. Okay. Okay. Um, hmm. So I need to push that and somehow still get back to the box so I can go... Oh, okay. This is odd. Um... I want to go through here, thank you. There we go. So I've got to actually go through and let the box... Let me go back to that box, which means I need to make sure I'm very tight around these corners. So to out show my ability, my finesse when dealing with uh, tight spaces. Hello. Uh oh. No, I want to... Okay. There's my finesse when dealing with tight spaces. It is nothing. Oh! Yeah. Hey, that time I thought I had a good good plan, but then I just screwed up the, yeah, the setup. So, you know, fair enough. Okay, so, attempt two. I'm gonna stay very close to this because I need to come back. Like so. And push this, like so. Yep. I need me to get around there because I won't have to, so. Go this way, like so. Yes. And can I get down here? Yeah, I can. I can go here. 
And then I can pull back. And hopefully when I pull back, this wheel will go and destroy the other stuff and I can go through and get whatever that is. So go through, do your thing. Fantastic. Can I push you back this way now? There we go. Go friend. And then pull this back. Sorry. And then go up here. Alright, this is looking more successful. The problem is I don't know what I can and can't touch, so... Okay. Let's just... Oh god, I did the wrong thing. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay. I think, basically, though, you're getting the idea here. You've either got to be able to, like, visualize your entire trip in one go, or just, like... a bit of... oh no, that was too far. Yeah, that's too far. I'm sorry. I've already lost that. I'm just gonna die. Um, there's no way I, could, I was close enough. My, uh... My finesse is limited, apparently. There we go. Yeah, so basically when you're pulling something like this, you've got to think about where you're going, where you need to go. And just make sure you do everything in the right way. Like, do the exact opposite of what I'm doing, basically. Because I, I completely forgot my own plan there, because I was too worried about getting that thing. Okay. The point is, this is an interesting game. And you know what? As much as I'm not sure I would have bought this if it was, you know, if I wasn't going through my entire mountain of shame and I wasn't trying to avoid playing uh, Sakura games. Like, it's not bad. Like, for 70 cents, if you were looking for a really quick... Okay, I keep saying that, but... I... <laughs> oh! Look at this. Okay. Strategy aid, indestructibility. Okay, that's nice too. You know what? A game that's just like, yeah, you're not going very well here. Would you like some help? So indestructibility, so you won't get hurt. That's fantastic because you get to find out the exact path you need to take without worrying. Basically, that's that's brilliant. How about strategy aid? That was his strategy aid. So I'm pretty sure I get. Okay. Oh, interesting. Okay. So at least she's like, okay, now your next goal is this. Okay, cool, it's... <gasps> wait, was my next goal actually... Wait, 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 wait. I think I misunderstood what it said. Did it say actually go up? Was I doing this whole the wrong thing? Okay, I was going the harder way, apparently. I wasn't meant to pull that at all, I don't think. It's going this. Let's see, so if I'm right, maybe I got to go through here. Then push this. Okay. <laughs> Um, that did not work as I was expecting, so I'm guessing maybe I... Oh, no, no, I'm guessing I was actually probably right the first time. The strategy aid... Or is it? Wait, let me have a look at the strategy aid again. I think there are probably multiple ways around this, but let's have a look at the strategy aid properly. 3 and 11. Okay, so it wants you to push it down there. But when I pushed it down there, it didn't go that way. So one, two, three, and then go four, then five, and then six again to push the other way, then seven through there, then eight, then nine. Wow, okay, that is not what I was planning. That is, you know what, that's cool. Like, I like the idea that instead of being like shaming you for not doing very well, it's just like, yeah, by the way, there is one way which we were planning. I don't know if it's what you, you were thinking, but hey, I'm still not sure how I'm meant to actually do that because I'm not sure how I can get around. Like, it, it didn't go straight, so, oh yeah, that's right, because I'm not meant to go down there, I'm meant to go across 3 and 11. I just completely forgot my own thing, so all that. Go up, then go push it, and let's keep going along. Sorry, it's just because I feel like I need to go there, but apparently I don't. So, push that. Bam. Okay, then go over here. Oh, shoot. Probably need that instructability too, to be honest, but anyway. Now I push it here. There we go. Then I grab this. 
We can just drop it here to push it over. Yeah, that's fair. Okay. Oops. You know what? That's interesting. I'll give it that. I like that. That's cute, actually. So, I see, I actually was failing for a reason, guys. I was actually was failing for a reason, see? Oh, ye of little faith! Uh... I actually don't know if that's correct, but hey, let's go through this way. Probably wasn't. I think I missed one of the things, but that's okay. Oh no, there it goes. Interesting, so the strategy guide goes away once it thinks you know what you're doing. That's nice, and kind of interesting. So you know, like, that's cool, that, that's nice, it's, and it gives <laughs> one more please. Uh, okay, so I'm pretty certain that my timer is about to go off. Um, yeah, two minutes away. I guess I can do a little more, but I'll, I'll talk while I'm throwing it to you. Look, for 70 odd cents or whatever I paid for this, this puzzle puzzle game is, you know, not bad. Some big holes are too, lines are too big to strip fill through narrow holes. Oh, oh, okay. If you try to pull them through, they will simply drop out of your hand. Oh. Honestly, okay, I'm just actually going straight to the strategy. No, wait. I won't get straight, sorry guys. But like, I'm just gonna fail this mission over and over again while I'm talking. Um, so essentially though guys, this is really quite interesting. I'll show you what the other way is. That's uh, that's not. You go up there first, I think. So basically though, this is this is actually quite interesting. It's it's a simple puzzle game, to, to no doubt. And I mean, it would be kid safe and kid friendly and kid doable and I can't even get my hand through a simple hole while I'm talking. That's probably a bad sign, actually, but oh well, I, I'm, I think I'm still mentally here, who knows? Um, but you know, this, this game is interesting. So it's simplistic enough that kid could play. It's, it's light-hearted, and for honestly 70 cents, you know, you could do worse. You could definitely, definitely do worse. There we go, so if I go here... No, that is not the way to go. I'm regretting everything about my choices now. Okay, cool. Anyway, so that's it, guys. That's the end of this video. Um, look, grab the bottle. Um, what can I say? It's not terrible. Um, I don't know how many levels it's got, so it's got, it seems to have a, another page over here, so... Can't get there yet, but hey. It seems to be about this guy growing up with his abnormally long, stretchy hand that I'm sure he won't use for anything bad. Because it's a kid's game. Well, not kid's game, but kid-friendly. Oh, actually, I see playtime. Outdoors. At grandma's. Okay, okay. And then seeing my shameful display on some of those. 11 deaths on this one before it was just like, By the way, you suck. You know what? No, it didn't do that. It was nice. Bonus level. It's a bonus level. Um, wait, why is it a bonus level? Like, oh, I don't want to grab the bird egg. No, I don't want to, I don't want to grab the bird egg, but still. I'm guessing just grabbing sausage, I suppose. Did the bird noise though? Ah, birches. Birch, please! Yeah, I just want to see how long this goes. Oh, apparently, a very long way. Ow. Oh, well. Anyway, you get the idea. This is, this is being grabbed the bottle. This is being grabbed the bottle. If you like simple puzzle games, uh, okay. If you like simple puzzle games, maybe give it a go. The links will be in the description below. Um, it's currently on sale on Steam. It probably goes on sale quite a lot, but uh, I know what's happening there. Guys, either way, if you liked what you see, 
Um, feel free to go grab this, pick it up, have a good time. Um, and I'll see you next time on my Mountain of Shame.